If you think about it, at weddings, the speeches are always made by men. The groom, best man, father of the bride. Well, we break with tradition again today. I mean, I can't say that I hold with it myself, but uh, that's <laughs> <laughs> So please give the very best of order while we hear a few words from Stacey. Oh, the battery. I'll have to be loud. <laughs> you can do that. I mean, I've got to follow that. That was bad enough. <clears throat> so, hi everyone. I can't say I'm the best at public speaking. I've done one line. <laughs> <laughs> but how can I not say anything on such a big day for my best friends? When I've been so lucky to be a special part of their day. I've decided on so many ways to do this speech and change my mind again and again for over a year. I've half written songs, jotted on countless bits of paper and made more notes than I can remember. But I actually don't think it matters because you both already know how much you mean to me. I just wanted to share how amazing you both are on your special day and I hope this captures that. To start, can I just say, how beautiful does my best look? <laughs> you are stunning. Helping you into your dress today, I stood back and I was in awe of you. Lizzie and I may not have grown up together as friends, but we have definitely grown together. As the saying goes, it's not how long you've been in someone's life, it's about the ones that come into your life and never leave. Well, I'm sorry, but you're still with me now. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Our friendship began seven years ago, when Lizzie welcomed me into her life and home. Because she knew how much her then babies meant to me. <laughs> Even worse than I thought. <laughs> The more time we spent together, we both realised how similar we were. Whether that's a good thing, or we're just bad influencers, who knows? <laughs> Definitely bad influencers. <laughs> Definitely, especially for the Chinese. Yeah, man. <laughs> I do know we couldn't do life without each other now. We just clicked as best friends, and have spoken every day since. Watching Lizzie bloom over the last seven years has been an honour. I am so grateful to share such special memories with you. Shortly after Lizzie and I became friends, Lizzie and David met. I'm sure Lizzie won't mind me saying that this time, her heart wasn't open to love. She wasn't expecting to meet someone and fall in love. She was focused on herself and her children. <laughs> then comes in a gentle giant and changes everything. <laughs> I'm sure David won't mind me saying his heart wasn't ready for love either. They had both been hurt before and were apprehensive and decided a friendship would be for the best. But it wasn't going to work. How could it? The more time these two spent together and convincing each other they were just good friends, the more they both grew. They began falling in love. Their hearts grew softer and day by day their walls came down. They made each other smile and laugh more than I had ever seen. Their eyes grew bright again, brighter than before. They didn't have to say anything to each other. Just being in the room together made each other happy. David loved how Lizzie made him love having fun again. And Lizzie loved how David made her laugh. They just quite simply are made for each other. <laughs> there was something else in life. David never knew he needed children. To say David was petrified <laughs> of becoming a part of William and Amelia's life would be fitting. He didn't want to mess up. Little did he know he would be the best thing to ever happen to all three of them. You both should be so proud <laughs> of these two young adults and how you've nurtured them, helped them grow and achieve all they want in life so far. 
The way David goes above and beyond for his little family is so beautiful to watch. These two are genuinely the most hardworking, committed, generous and loving people I've ever met in my life. I want you... <laughs> I want to say thank you for honestly changing my life. You will never know how much you mean to me. I couldn't think of better people to have the best days out with, to carpool karaoke with, to go to the theatre with, double date with, to find the best restaurants and of course cocktails and just sit on the sofa putting the world to rights. The word family has multiple definitions. For me, I think family is somewhere you feel at home with people who make you feel loved, blessed and want nothing but the best for you. That is what Lizzie, David, William and Amelia are to me. All four of you, I love you all. <laughs> To sum it up, Lizzie, I hope David continues to crack you up. And David, I hope checking Lizzie's butt out never gets off. <laughs> <laughs> May you both have a marriage full of laughter, happiness, joy, and most of all love. Because if anyone deserves it, it's you too. Yeah. To the riding room. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. taking us to lots of different places, showing us the world and making me laugh. When, you both, when you're both together, I see how much you love each other and how much you need each other. When we are all together, I feel happy and love that we're together. You two getting married means we're a family forever. Aww. Aww. <laughs> 